Well, he came out of the wooded area by the two telephone poles. Came up to me and asked me for a smoke. So I handed him a smoke, and then he played with it, looked at it, and then handed it back to me. Then he went back and forth a couple times, and then the last time he came by me, he walked right by me, walked up to the sidewalk, went about 20 feet across the bridge, uh, the bridge where the dam is, I walked across and jumped in. And then I ran over to him, trying to tell him to get out and what's wrong with him. And he wouldn't get out and he just kept going. I was like, come on, dude, get out. And I stopped the little truck and asked him if he had a phone. And then he said, yeah. And then he said, there's an officer like a block away. And I was like, that's too far. And then there was another one right on the corner here. So I ran to him while he went down to shoot. I told him, hey, there's a guy that jumped down and went down to shoot. And I said, I got to go. And I tried to find him and we couldn't find him anymore. So yeah, that's pretty much it.